That was pretty shattering. It, it altered my life quite a bit. Zeth Williams Benner was 16 when his father, Frank Williams, was killed. He was very funny. He had a, the charisma about him. He says his dad had some troubles. They only saw each other from time to time. In August 2008, Williams was homeless around Portland when police say he walked to Kennedy Park. There, a fight broke out between Williams and a large group of men. He was chased, beaten, and stabbed multiple times. I saw that they were holding a press conference and and I tuned in and watched it and realized who it was. Two people have been indicted and are in custody for the 2008 murder of Frank Williams. What was that like to see this happen? Well, I, it's been over 24 hours now. I still haven't fully processed it. He says he would think about his dad each year around the anniversary and spend time with his own kids. This time went on and they never made any arrests. What did you think of the police investigation? Yeah, I didn't have much hope after, you know, a few years. I figured that this was a cold case that would probably never be solved. But there was always a little hope, especially as investigators made big breaks with other old crimes. Just a small piece of information might be what gets us over that finish line. Court dates for 36-year-old Shane Hall and 30-year-old Kang Tran, now accused of Williams' murder, haven't been set yet. Both are already in prison for other unrelated crimes. I'm looking forward to seeing what happens and what happens to these guys and hopefully they spend their lives behind bars. There are 12 remaining cold cases left in Portland. Tonight at 6, what he would say to other families still waiting for any developments. In Portland, Melmire, CBS 13 News.